Well, I'd like to welcome everybody to meet a, a good friend and a remarkable co-laborer in Christ. His name is Tim Anderson, and he's been a faithful global partner in Ecuador for how many years? 36. 36. That is, that is remarkable. And uh, so we're thrilled for the opportunity for a conversation with you. Um, somewhere around uh, the fall of 2018, our church actually started a capital campaign to expand our facilities. At the same time, you presented an opportunity to build a leadership training center and seminary in the jungles of Ecuador. We thought that this was actually a God moment for us. We knew we didn't want to think about our place as all our resources need to be consumed here. We've always known that we should help the gospel go forward to the nations of the world. And in fact, our goal in that was to raise about $5,000 to help purchase property. Uh, the amount of money that came in while we were in a capital campaign was actually over $13,000. And so we were thrilled to be able to, to support you at that level. I'm just wondering if you could give us any updates. How is that project going? Uh, where is that? And, and uh, any, any information would be super helpful. Yes, we did uh, start and we were there with you in, in uh, 2018 and started uh, the project uh, shortly after that. And the 13,000 that you did raise was major in getting us kicked off because as we start, we had three teams in 2019 to kick it off in January and then February. And then there's the last one left on March 12th. Um, everything closed down, as you know, the next year and a half. And we have had none, but that those funds were enough to get us far enough down the road um, the, get, we got the foundation for the seminary built at that time. Of course, some of the walls up and, and uh, the roof coming on. And we were able to work slowly over the next year and a half uh, with a small little team of national workers to keep building and actually got the building done and three apartments, one for administration and two for professors done during uh, that next year when we were totally shut in. 